Warning, this video contains images of feral pests being shot using a rifle of suitable calibre. Please do not watch if you are likely to be offended. Furthermore, if you make any comments that are either negative, political or religious, they will be removed from my channel. I've finally gotten around to making another video containing feral cats, along with the usual rats and pigeons, plus there is a bonus bunny rabbit thrown in for good measure. There will be a second warning before I show you the cats. Now it was a windy night out so I do apologise for the excessive wind noise and a few wayward shots. A few of the animals needed to be finished off at close range off camera. Anyways. Let's get on to the usual equipment description and then on with the show. As usual, Bob and I are using our FX Impact M3s, chambered in .22, with the ATN 4K Pro scope on top and the ABL ballistic laser. We are also both using the JSB Hades pellets, weighing in at 15.89 grains. Also during the night, Bob is using his Tika T1 chambered in 0.17 HMR and I'll be using my CZ452 American chambered in 0.22 on some of the big cats. All of our rifles are fitted out with the ATN Excite 4K Pro digital scope and the ABL ballistic laser. In some of the videos I get some thermal shot and that is through my Axion XM30S from Pulsar. And here we have Bob studying us off for the night and his second rat turns out to be a helicopter tail. Get to the chopper! With the metal bar in the way, Bob had to bide his time to get that perfect shot. This rat was trying out for the Swamp Rat dive team, but he didn't like the water. Maybe he'd be better off going for the Luge team. Time now for a few of my shots. There's not much I can see of this rat, but 
I can see his heart and lung area and that's where the pellet went. So he didn't get very far. Here's that bonus bunny rabbit I spoke about. It's time for the tryouts for the Swamp Rats diving team. With a nice backward entry, that's certainly got to increase the difficulty. Failure to enter the water is an automatic disqualification. And here's the winner for the night, a 9.5 for a nice clean entry. If these last two rats decide they don't want to be in the diving team, there's always a spot for them in the synchronised swimming team.
Initially, I thought this rat was already dead, but the pellet proved me wrong. Headshot. I think a little bit of grey matter may have been displaced by this shot. I'm pretty sure that's not a miss. Let's wait and see. Yep, here he comes. Whee! Come on little fella, give me a little bit more of a target. Thank you. We Yes, you've guessed it, it's time for rapid fire. Whee! I've had a few people complain that using we've got a bleeder is inappropriate so we'll try this one. What the fuck?
Let's hope they like that one better. Come to think of it, it is my channel after all. We got a bleeder! This next rat refused to turn and face the music, so it was time for a Texas enema. We'll make this one the last rat for the night. But don't worry, there's still the pigeons and the cats to come. It's time to let the feathers fly and the pigeons are down next. Or is it up next? Either way, you know what I mean. This next one's not a pigeon, it's a starling, and the farmer wants them gone as well. Here we have two birds. Both look fairly similar, but can you tell me which one is the non-native invasive species? That's right, boys and girls, it's the one that's about to get a Texas enema because they work just as well on birds as they do on rats. This other bird is a crested dove, which is native to Australia, and therefore I won't shoot it.
We tried for a double on this one, but Bob missed his intended target. I didn't know. And now it's time for the last pigeon. Here we go, this is what you've been waiting for. Warning, this video contains images of feral pests, in particular cats, being shot using a rifle of suitable calibre. Please do not watch if you are likely to be offended. I will add a link to this web page of the Australian Government for the Department of Agriculture, Water and the Environment describing how bad feral cats can be. So please, before you attack me for doing a task that needs to be done here in Australia, I suggest you go to this website and have a read, or do your own Google research on feral cats and their destructiveness here in Australia. If you do leave a comment that is abusive, insulting or threatening, it will be removed from my channel. It is simple as that. I'm not doing anything illegal. This is a task that needs to be done. It may be my rectangle in the main image, but it was actually Bob who took the shot. He just forgot to hit record before he pulled the trigger. Even though this was a good clean headshot, it wasn't enough to take him down, so we had to go around the corner and finish him off at close range. I hope the wait was worth it for all those cats. The total tally for the night was 9 pigeons, 1 starling, 
one rabbit, 102 rats, and most importantly, 10 cats. Well, I promised and I delivered. And to make things even better, the next few videos will contain more cats. Someone asked for a rapid fire cat compilation. What do you think? Worth a try? Thanks again for watching. If you like my videos, please hit the like and subscribe button. To get notifications of new videos, click on the bell. So until next time, please stay safe, keep calm and gently squeeze the trigger.